Hello guys, welcome to the HODL EOS channel. My name is Rob. Hit that subscribe button, click that notification bell to join the HODL gang. In this video, we are going to walk through DeFiBox. DeFiBox is a token swap application on EOS, which received funding from Nudex Seed. If you are familiar with the Nudex swaps, you should be familiar with this. Nudex swaps is now on DeFiBox as well as USN Generation. Nothing in this video is financial advice. I am not a financial advisor. What you do with your tokens is up to you. But let's get into it and walk through the DeFi Box application. DeFi Box has quickly become the biggest source of liquidity for EOS tokens, with currently $20 million locked in USD value. If we look at the stats, that's over 6.3 million EOS in liquidity in the swap pools and a really good volume that continues to increase day after day with 2.64 plus million EOS worth of 24 hour swap volume. Starting off with the swap pool, of course you need to be logged in with your EOS account which can be done up here if you're not logged in already. If you are logged in, you will see your account name. And on the homepage at defibox.io, it starts you off in the swap section on the swap page. This is where you perform token swaps, swapping from a token to another token. So for this example, I wanna swap into some EOS, click the middle arrow button here to flip these around. And I want to move from, let's move from some VIG into some EOS, select the token you wanna to move from in the left hand box, and the token you want to move to in the right hand box and input the amount of tokens and it'll show you how much you receive on the other end now if you sit on this screen for too long you might get an error when you try to swap saying something about token prices moving too much or something about volatility if that is the case what you need to do is a simple refresh here and to get the most current pricing data just hit the refresh button down here. That'll refresh everything. So I am going to swap a thousand VIG for 3.8008 EOS. Simply click the swap button and your wallet will pop up. I'm using Scatter. And the DeFi box account is swap.defi. So I am sending these thousand VIG to swap.defi. And when I allow that, I will receive the three. 0.8 something EOS and if we look on the blocks block Explorer after I just completed that action I sent over a thousand vig and immediately got back 3.8008 EOS in the same transaction that is how you swap tokens on DeFi box swap button at the top swap button again here and then choose what token you want to move from, what token you want to move to. Also on the swap page, there is the liquidity section. This is where you can add tokens to the liquidity pool. So if you would like to add liquidity to a pool, you would select which pairs, which pair you want to add to, EOS to box, EOS to anything you want, any pair to any pair, click add liquidity or if you already have liquidity added to a pool, your liquidity will show up just below it. So down here you can see I already have some VIG and EOS added into the VIG EOS pool. If I wanted to add more liquidity to that or remove some liquidity, I would use the manage button and I can either add liquidity or li reduce liquidity. So going back up to the top section here, I'm just going to do the EOS VIG pool and click add liquidity. And you can see it's the same box I get as if I came down to manage. Here's add liquidity as well. So I'm going to add in those EOS plus the corresponding amount of VIG to the EOS VIG pool. All you do is input the amount of one side and it'll auto populate the other side. So here I am depositing 
3.8009 EOS and 997.1329 VIG to the EOS VIG pool. And to add, simply confirm it, your wallet will pop up, positing that 3.8 EOS to swap DeFi, depositing that 997 VIG to swap.DeFi and sending the swap DeFi deposit action for the pair I am adding to. Allow that. Successfully increased. Now you can see my liquidity went up from whatever it was to 15.8 EOS and the co corresponding amount of VIG tokens. Now, since I have added tokens to a pool that has a, a mining weight for box token mining, I will receive box tokens every hour and these can be claimed up in the mine box section so click mine box and here you will see the amount you can claim a box tokens released every second and settle every hour so every hour on the hour if you have liquidity in the pool you will see this amount of box increase and to claim you simply click the claim button claim your wallet will pop up with a mine1.defi claim action with your account name. Allow that and you claim your box tokens. You see that in the explorer as well. Sent the claim action and was sent the box tokens that I claimed. Now if you'd like, these box tokens can be staked for EOS rewards and for voting on governance proposals. Up at the top, you will see staking dividend. In staking dividend, you will see your stake as well as the EOS you can claim. This EOS will increase every hour, just like the box from the previous screen. To stake or unstake your box, you come to the manage button. Here, it'll show you how much you have staked and how much that is unstaked that you can stake. To stake those, simply click them or fill in the amount you want to stake. Confirm stake.defi, stake action, account name, and the box tokens you are staking. Allow that. Now my box are staked. And to unstake, the exact opposite, unstake box. Input the amount you want to unstake. Confirm the action. Only certain liquidity pools receive the box tokens. And that list can be found in the mine box section. If you scroll down, you will see the mining weight list for the pairs that do receive box token mining and their corresponding mining weights. So only liquidity added to these pools on this list will mine box tokens just by adding liquidity to the pools. Also, if you click over to the swap, you can see the swap mining pools. So, so box token holders that have their tokens staked have voted to have mining weights for swapping these three pairs, this one goes till September 27th, this one goes till September 11th, this one goes to September 27th as well, and their corresponding mining weights under the mining details swap section. And speaking of governance, when you stake your box tokens, you are able to vote on governance proposals. Currently, there is no interface within DeFiBox.io, the PC desktop version. The BoxDAO proposal portal can be found in the mobile version, so in mobile wallets that support DeFiBox, or by visiting dap.defibox.io brings up the mobile version of DeFiBox. And to get to the voting, come up to the triple line up here, click on that, and then box DAO. If you click box DAO, it will show you the proposals that you can vote on. There are no current proposals. All of these have been executed, but if there was an open proposal, I could click on it and cast my vote, agree or disagree, and submit my vote. So again, the box DAO voting is only on the mobile version at this time. When I reached out to the team, they were not able to give me a date on, on when it would be available on the desktop version of DeFi Box. So there you go, guys. There's a walkthrough of the DeFi Box application. In the swap section, you have 
your classic token swap, swap one token for another, and the liquidity section where you can add liquidity, add tokens to a pool. And if you add liquidity to a pool that mines box tokens, in the mine box section up at the top is where you will see every hour your box tokens increase and you can claim them by clicking the claim button. And if you want to stake these box, head over to the staking dividend section, go to manage, stake your box, and that gives you access to being able to vote on box DAO governance and you are able to claim EOS dividends as well. If you found this walkthrough helpful, drop a like, make sure you're subscribed, click on that notification bell to join the HODL gang. I'll leave a link to d5box.io in the description and check out the other links as well. Follow HODL EOS on Twitter. But that's going to do it for me for this one, guys. I will see you in the next one.